All right, we got to talk about this. Um, Howie Carr Dope. is um, a Boston right wing talk show host. Uh, not the brightest bulb on the tree, but none of them are, to be fair. He had uh, Representative Louis Gohmert, who has a lot to say to the folks in Boston, of course. And um, Gohmert has an interesting theory about the assassination of the U.S. assassination of Anwar al-Awlaki. Now, we have um, discussed this, I don't know, know, dozens of times more uh, on this program in terms of the, the, the kill list, essentially, that the Obama administration has created, the, um, the legitimacy of a targeted assassination, broadly speaking, but also of American citizens, and the assassination of Anwar al awlaki's 16-year-old son, who was trying to find him uh, two weeks later. Louis Gohmert has a very different take on this than we do. He's not so concerned about the targeted assassination program as much as he is as to why they took out Anwar al awlaki Senator Phil Graham, uh, former Senator Phil Graham. I can't uh, imitate Senator Graham very well, but anyway, he said, we always fund, we always feed the dogs that are trained to bite us. And I thought, yeah, that's what we're still doing. (laughs) We're still (laughs) feeding the dogs that are trained to bite us. And no, I'm not saying Muslims are dogs. They're not. I've got very good friends around the world that I count on to help keep, um, you know, the world safe as it is. Uh, They don't want radical Islamists. One of them uh, is who Trump just met with. Yeah, uh, Al-Sisi. President Al-Sisi over from Egypt. And we were angry. The administration was angry when he overthrew the Muslim Brotherhood in Egypt. Didn't they briefly cut off American aid, uh, military aid to the Egyptians? Yes, and of course, um, yeah, and Obama demanded that they put the Muslim Brotherhood guy, Morsi, yeah. back. And, uh, oh, and by the way, Morsi is another one of those that had his wife come to America to have a child so they could have an American oh, citizen. Oh, uh, an Al- anchor Al- baby. Yeah. We can't say anchor baby but, anymore, though, Al- can we? Al- Al-Awlaki, you know, the, the guy, the, the first American killed with, intentionally with a drone yeah. strike because he was too dangerous and his name keeps coming up yeah. with Rohingya and all this stuff. Al-Awlaki was where his parents were from Yemen. They came to the U.S. on a college visa, had Al-Awlaki, took him back to Yemen, taught him to hate America, and that's why they couldn't keep uh, this terrorist Al-Awlaki from coming in. And I think one of the reasons they needed to blow him up with a drone strike is if he'd ever been caught, arrested, he would have sung about all the different people yeah. he worked with in the administration. I, I and I mean, we've got pictures of him taking leading prayers with the uh, Capitol Hill staffer, Muslim uh, staffers here on Capitol Hill. Uh, I got to so stop you. I got to stop you there. Through. Yeah, you got to stop him there. Um, Al Waki was actually hired by the U.S. government um, to go around and be an emissary at one time, and I believe that was during the Bush administration. We got to call uh, Obama, tell him to kill a lock or else I, I won't be able to run for president. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. You're not going anywhere, anyways. Sky will sing, I swear to God. <laughs> Doesn't know the code of the street. He's got no backbone. He's a pussy. Put the screws to him on one point. We've got him. to get to our walkie to get the secret messages. We can print it on Breitbart. We'll do a flow chart of all the Muslim Brotherhood who control the Obama administration. I swear to God, if that Elmer Fudd guy gets his hands on him, the whole thing's ruined. <laughs> Light him up. <laughs> Jesus. Well, La Wakbar. All right, let's go to the phone. Please forgive me, my Muslim <clears throat> brother. Hopefully, Allah will shine upon you, but I can't trust that you keep your lips sealed. <laughs> 
Hey, folks, Sam Cedar here. I just got back from a uh, company-wide meeting. Accounting is really coming down on me hard. We need to get to 100,000 subscribers as soon as possible. So uh, please, enjoy this uh, channel. Subscribe. Right up. Right up. Down. Right down there.